Okay, so we're given this exponential equation. We've got that variable up there in the exponent uh, spot. The first thing you can try to do is get the bases to be the same, but two and 18 don't really have a common base. So we're gonna have to use logarithms. And the first thing I would do here is I would um, take the log of both sides of the equation. Now you could take log base two, you could take log base 10. It doesn't really matter, but in this case, I'm gonna take the log base two of both sides. And the reason I'm doing that is because log base two and an exponential function with base two, those are inverses, they cancel one another out. So we have x plus one now equals log base two of 18. Now all we have to do is just subtract one from both sides of the equation. So we get x equals negative one plus log base two of 18. Don't make the mistake of subtracting the one from, from the 18. And now you can go to your calculator and you can simplify. Now, some calculators don't have the ability to take the log base two. They only have log base 10, that's the common log, or log base e, that's the natural log. So you can write this as log base 10 of 18 over log base 10 of two, and then you know add the negative one. And I did this earlier, this came out to uh, 4.17 uh, plus the negative one, so that final answer is gonna be 3.17 approximately. Okay, approximately 3.17. If you're new to the channel or if you're a long time viewer, consider subscribing. You know, this channel is all about making learning math less stressful so that you can raise your grade, pass your class, and go on to pursue your dreams. I look forward to helping you with this channel, with my future videos, and um, I'll see you in the future videos. I'll talk to you soon.